What's the name of your dog? Gari and Tapio have two dogs. Yeah? Yes. Two pugs. Yeah, it's like the, the French bulldog, right? No, they it's called? a pug. pug. I mean, they're related. Ah. Uh, but they, they look a little bit the same. They have the same, like, with the um, nose. The pugs have, like, like the, the, the ears are kind of... Down. Down. They don't go up. Did they get, get the muscular? Like they are muscular. They are strong. But when they're like puppies, they like eat like stronger in the head. Yeah. So for me, like the biggest innovation is the continuous monitor. I mean, it's allowed in like in cycling. There's so much numbers, and now we can have live data. It allows you to like make decisions in real time, whereas before it was all just finger sticks. So for me, like the biggest innovation is the continuous monitor. Nice. Just guessing before, I guess. Yeah, before, to a certain extent, yeah. You because like, you take uh, measurement at the, at, the, at the start and then in the finish. You know? Yeah, and you, hope, and you hope it was right. Yeah. Like when you look at like the numbers, uh, like in real time, it's like when you see your power, you know, and yeah. the determining factor is like the number of your glucose. So, like if you've got your threshold, but you know that number and you know your zone. So if you mm -hmm. know where you work in, in like your relative range for your blood glucose, it puts that number and like you make a decision based on that number. So if you know it, like you say before you test and then you test and if it's both in range, you don't know what's happened in the middle. Yeah, exactly. The current challenge for me is like to definitely, um, because we have off seasons and to find out like what the, you know, you need to adjust everything according to, because you train less or you barely do anything a day because you just rest and your whole body basically resets and you need to do everything. Every day is different. Yeah, yeah. like it's, I really feel like home is the easiest environment to control diabetes. Kind of like say you have a training routine, you know what to do day in, day out and you have your food, you know what to eat. You have all the supplies there and just like, I don't know, it's easier diabetes wise. Yeah, and always when nice you travel, steady, and you, yeah. yeah, say you have an easy week, if that happens at home, it, yeah, you're gonna have to adjust and it's gonna be hard initially, I find. Mm -hmm. like, also off season, the first three days, you're all over the place because like the yeah. body doesn't know. I wanna get across to everyone that like, it's not perfect for us, you know. Yeah, I, don't, I want true. people to look up to us and gain inspiration from us, but also realize that we're like you, you know, yeah. we're like everybody else. It's yeah. not that we have perfect control, and perfect control is not really the objective, you know, yeah. is as good a control as you can have yeah. in your lifestyle. And people need to realize that that is a yeah, balance in everyday yeah. life, you know. So, a challenge for me is just not so being so hard on myself with diabetes isn't easy, but don't overthink the situation. Yeah. Uh, I think Tim asked us in one race, like, what do you find the hardest with diabetes in the race? I said, like, just, just, racing, uh, <laughs> just racing. The level is so high now. Yeah. Like, the diabetes is the last thing yeah, I think is. about yeah, in the yeah, hard race. It's like, yeah. I know my routine. I know how to eat, take insulin, whatever. Yeah. But, yeah, yeah. like, just the fact that the level is crazy it's high really at the moment yeah. and, like, just I staying guess. in the race. People who have diabetes ask you questions. They all think we just sit around and talk about diabetes the yeah. whole time. Yeah. You know, it's probably the now. least, but it's probably the least yeah. talked about topic in the team. You know, yeah. everyone talks about everything. How was that because, race? Yeah, yeah exactly. Brutal. So um, that's a good side. You know, we all understand everyone's yeah. situation. So although it's a challenge, it's a challenge for everyone, which makes it like not cancel out, but mutual, you know? So yeah, everyone true. understands that if you're having a, an off day because yeah. your sugars aren't quite where they want to be, everyone just kind of has been like situation. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But like this thing you mentioned, like in, in Belgium, this race, that you see them sprinting and you're still breaking <laughs> for the car. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Everybody was like, yeah. I, I don't think you put my blood sugar at this moment. Go I think it's definitely something like uh, that the CGMs get like super consistent because sometimes for me it's not always perfect reading yeah. and definitely in races there's like a in, yeah and that's something I really want to have changed so it gets better and also yeah like the hope of every diabet diabetic is like a cure but we don't know if that ever, happ ever happens and yeah, then we're like a bunch of X diabetic cyclists. For me, more, more important is the trend. Yeah. So if I'm going 
lower and I, I, I feel it in my body, you know? Yeah, yeah. And whether it's um, four or three millimole, it doesn't yeah. make a huge difference yeah, to me. Course, yeah. And I can like correct it yeah, and yeah. then I see it in the trend anyway. Yeah. It doesn't matter if it's six or seven, you know, yeah. once I get it right. But as long as the trend is right as well, yeah. I guess. Yeah, 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 of course the trend has to be right. Yeah. That has to be accurate. Yeah. Um, I don't know if there's something with the insulin you could do. You could do like smart insulin that acts more when you're high yeah, and something acts like less that, when yeah. you're low. Something that's like in that's your body, like, like you take maybe yeah. like a, a pill, you know, or an implant and something that they talk about like this, I'm sure I've read it somewhere, it's like, a, like you say, like a pill and when your blood sugar is at a certain level, it starts to access that and it releases in your body. And then like the higher you go, the more it would release that sort of thing. So you could, something like this would be pretty cool. Yeah. But like the roundup of that is basically something to take the deflection away from you as the as the user, you know, because yeah. we I think I read somewhere 180 more 180 decisions per day more for the person with diabetes. So if you can alleviate any one of 180, it's nice, you know, it's nice to not have to make those decisions and it's all crazy. But I mean like as long as we have the team, you know, at the moment the team is great. We get so much outreach from everyone and, and although it's not an, a significant sort of um, technolo like technology advancement, but it, it allows us to give like a spearhead to the diabetes front and gives people something to look forward to, something to look at, something to raise hope, you know. I kind of wish uh, people could see that, especially diabetics, that say, you did a good performance, you get a good result in a race. You might, your blood sugar might have been all over the place. Yeah. Like it actually didn't matter that yeah, much. Yeah, yeah. Um, it's just all about the legs and you could, could have had really good legs without like being yeah. perfectly flat on, yeah, yeah. on the blood and sugar. And it's like, it's, 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 it's yeah, and yeah. it's totally fine yeah. to be 300 at the start of the race. Like you might do an awesome race, but not yeah, of course, it doesn't yeah, yeah. matter. Like just the fact that diabetes doesn't have to be something that decides the day. Yeah, you know? it's not the determining factor. It's like, like you still have to race whether you're 100, 200, 250, 180. Like no matter what you have to. No, you, uh, exactly. <laughs> just stop a second. I need to yeah, make sure. Yeah, 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 exactly. So in range, out of range, you just give your best Whatever always. You, can, you know, yeah. you can't ask for more. So. Yeah. I think that's a wrap. Ciao. When another? And, oh, more. Andiamo. Oh, there's the pineapple. Oh.